Hey all, welcome to Frozen Pirate Ship, the third location of the Winter Bender story. And looks like we have some ice balls here as well. So make sure you place them well enough. I mean, don't waste energy moving them around because they do cost a significant amount of energy. like we are here for some fun we got to defeat some pirates these huts are enterable and contain some nice things okay some more food definitely worth checking out Okay, now the goal is to consume as less energy as possible, but we still have to move uh, quite a lot of those. I think this was the best way. get around this choose to waste some energy well I got myself stuck and need to put it back there so what could I possibly do it's not that hard to figure out I was just trying to consume as less energy as possible We might as well get that experience. Hmm, I shouldn't have moved it that much. I moved it one extra time. Hence, I wasted some energy. Okay, let's quickly continue. I guess I wasted quite some time already. The ship is probably our objective. I'm not sure where we are going because it looks like ahead we have to go somewhere. That's probably the second site. The ship here might be the first one. I think I should check out the ship. Okay, the pirates have already flew just by seeing Diggy. So that's what Diggy is. And side one of three. I'm not sure if the other sides are inside the ship or outside but since I'm here I'm going to go inside the ship That's a key to something Let's see, maybe the other cabin or 
Dex, I will call that. Is this a bonus? Oh yes, it is a bonus. So I found my first bonus of this story. So far I found nothing. And I don't think there are any either. But just if I find anything later, I will mention in the comments or description of the respective video. For now, I think this is it for the ship part. We should continue ahead for the next site. And this looks like something energy consuming. Because this ball here should not be there. We have to pull this back to be able to proceed. Pull this down and then go around from there. If the experience is just one tile away, I don't think it's a bad idea to get it. But if it's like uh, too far, then it's not worth it. Hmm, I'm not sure where I'm going. But let me continue. You can push this all the way through. There is the second divine ice. No, I mean not second. The way to the second site. Not going there yet. Have to clear the two tiles first. And that was quite energy consuming. That's okay. I have to dig all the tiles anyway. So not even half yet. Still got two sides to find, so that's okay. Hmm, we seem to have a lot of room here, but might as well be an illusion. If you wanted that experience, then maybe you could have pushed this stone to the left first. I didn't do that. Maybe I will need to. Let's see. Now I don't need to go back, so I'm blocking my path to go back. And I hope that I have not missed any tile. We have some boxes here. Let me go and dig them. We can continue. This one looks like a little more fun than we had in the previous one. This is involving some more strategy and some more energy moving those stones around. like that's the second port and with some more pirates that are escaping on seeing Diggy. The third side seems to be across the shore. So these are just some extra tiles which also include an amethyst. So I'm going to go ahead and dig them first. Hmm, I'm not sure if I should take this to the end. But no harm in doing that. And since the experience is just one tile away, let's get that too.
Okay, I moved that stone one extra time. That's okay, you cannot repeat those mistakes. Okay, I can now go on to the ship, clear my second sight of divine eyes. I should check out those decks. Okay, I need a key here. Key must be obtained from here. That's the wooden key to the tower on the other side. And that has some more divine eyes. Okay, this pirate was storing it for his drink, but they like, won't let that happen. He is taking away all the divine eyes. Mm, looks like no bonus in this cabin like we had in the previous one. Anyway, time to continue towards the third side. That's still like 200 tiles more. of room here and the tiles were obtained quite easily and we can proceed just as easily so no big deal okay on to the third site and we have another amethyst here so that's nice I need to go a bit out of the way to get that amethyst. That's the way to continue but for the amethyst, this one should be pulled and still worth it to get it, not a lot of energy to reach it. This one can be put in our corner. Looks like we are going towards the third side and I missed a few tiles here so let me get the tiles first. And I will put it on the experience. Okay, let's continue our journey towards the last ship. Mm, looks like we need to pull this back. 
So we need some room. Okay, we got enough. the ship around 90 tiles left all must be the divine eyes and those cabins the last set of pirates have ran away Outside divine eyes must be done at this point. Let's get the key from this room as seen in the previous shapes and get some more in the other room. Then we shall be done unless we missed any tiles, which looks like the case. Well, probably not. We have all the tiles. So, we are done with the location here. And after this, to end the quest, we got to visit the repeatable. That will end the quest. And you can keep doing these repeatables as many times as you like and contribute to your region. And don't forget to exchange all that divine eyes or coins here. And in the end, don't forget to visit the rooms in the ice castle. Also, you must collect the keys from the achievement. Here is the first key. But you can't get that until the region has reached 12.5%. I mean, you can't use that one in the castle. You have to wait for the region to complete building it. Anyway. So that's all, thank you for watching, see you in the ice castle video which will come around in 3-4 to four days after whichever region reaches it first and it opens up completely. So thank you for watching, see you in the next one.